Hi everyone, I'm back with a recipe you might want to consider making this Christmas season. We have always loved cheesy baked oysters, but this has become an official Christmas dinner staple ever since I made this for my sister and her family. Surprisingly, even people in my family who are not especially fans of oysters love this. So here's what you're going to need for today's recipe. Butter, shallots, Creme fraiche, white wine, red crumbs, grated cheese, salt. black pepper and of course the star of the show fresh oysters first step is shucking the oysters which can be a bit intimidating first give the shells a good rinse in cold water this will remove any sand or loose shell pieces then grab a shucking knife and a dish towel, place the oyster flat side up on the towel, fold the towel over half of the shell and then place your hand on top of the towel. Then place the tip of the knife into the hinge of the oyster at the narrow end where the two shells meet. Next, twist the knife back and forth until it slides into the hinge. With a little force, pop the hinge. Then run the knife along the top inside of the flat shell to cut the muscle and then remove the top shell. Next, run the knife under the oyster to release it from the bottom shell. Once that's done, remove the liquid once, twice or as needed and then set aside while you do the rest of the oysters. Whatever happens, just always be careful in shucking oysters. I actually remember spending New Year's Eve at the hospital when I was a child one year because my dad had injured his hand pretty badly opening an oyster. Never been much about you. Don't get me wrong. If the oyster smells bad, do not hesitate to throw it away. So inspect the oysters well and throw away the liquid so you might have to do this once or twice. Now preheat the oven at 180 degrees Celsius. Next in a saucepan add the butter and let it melt. Then add the shallots to the saucepan and cook until translucent. Stir well and add one third of the white wine. Stir and on high heat bring to a boil. When it starts to boil, add more wine. Stir and repeat this until you've added all the wine. Boil on high heat and let the sauce reduce by half. Lower the heat to medium and add the creme fraiche. Stir. Don't forget to season with salt as well. Around you.
The sauce is now ready. Next, add some of the sauce on each oyster. Transfer the oysters on a baking pan. Top each oyster with a spoon of breadcrumbs and grated cheese. Season with black pepper. The oysters are now ready to go to the oven. Bake for 10 to 15 minutes at 180 degrees Celsius or until golden brown. There are times I can These briny baked oysters are super delicious. An easy to prepare appetizer which comes together really quickly. It is flavorful and is considered a delicacy around the world. It also has a chic vibe making it perfect for the holidays. Thank you for watching today's video and I hope that you liked it. Please let me know in the comments down below. Take care and I'll see you soon. Bye! Mm-hmm.